Hello everyone, hello. Welcome back to my channel. How are you guys doing? I hope you're good and keeping safe. How are you preparing for your s -mass celebration? This is a season of celebration. And not only celebration, it's just the last month before this 2022 will be wiped off. So celebrate yourself. Celebrate the God's grace in your life to see the ending of this year. Celebrate people around you. Reach out to one or two people, one or two widow or the less privileged, and God will bless you. Don't eat alone. Share with others. My name is Mama Assurance, the queen of positivity. And Assurance covers you that this recipe is going to work for you. To my return subscribers, I say thank you for always coming back to watch my video. I really do appreciate you. And for those of you that are coming up across my video for the first time, please subscribe, select to always be notified from the YouTube whenever I upload there another video and like and comment. Yes, yeah, somebody chatted me and said, Mama, sure the year is about to end. What are we going to use to clean our house? I'm going to make this video like part one, part two, part three. I don't know if I can explain like two in one video or one of the things that you can be using to clean your house in this season based on the... Based on the spiritual realm what is happening in the spiritual realm all right what you're going to use to clean your house what you're going to sprinkle in your house and what you're going to use to clean your house either on the 31st or the first of this month what you're going to put in your house to invite good things of the month now why we do all these things so that we don't want to remain stagnant we don't want to remain the same we want things to change for us okay yes what number one thing i have here i have brekessen this is brekessen okay but cut it like this like this you can cut it like this into two and soak it inside water Soak the water for at least about three hours. This bucket will be inside your water. It can be inside ordinary bucket of water. It can be direct into your bit, um, your mopping bucket. Okay, this is the bucket. You soak it for three hours. After three hours, you transfer the water to your mopping mopping uh, bucket. Okay, you see this is your onions. This is the onions. Uh, you can peel off the back of the onions, you can leave it. You just cut these onions, half of these onions, and dice it into three. Put it inside that water and get your salt, your salt, your salt. It may be a handful of salt inside that water and you reach, you reach Psalm 23, Psalm 24. And some 46 inside that water. Add more water to it. Now you can mop your house with your dead toy or Isa or whatsoever this event that you have to mop your house with your, your detergent. You can mop your house direct. But after that, this one is spiritual cleaning. Is spiritual cleansings of the home. So while you read those psalms, you read and decree and tell God, as you are going to clean this out, you are wiping away poverty. You are wiping away strange spirit. You are wiping away spirit of lack. You are wiping away quarrel. I told you guys there was one day, there's a particular seat where my highness usually sits down. Yeah, that very day, and I can uh, I can identify what happened during that period. That I was just passing, I just look at that seat spiritually, and I saw a heavy, heavy maggots, more than 20 on that particular chair. I have to go and pour salt on that particular chair. Now, this is the energies that are always coming inside the house. They couldn't go far because it's at the sitting room. It's the first chair by the door. They couldn't enter inside the house. 
they stop there. Do you know anybody that sits sat on that place can also get that energy and be having difficulty in business? I pour salt on that place for three days. I was praying and everything cleared off. When we talk about energy, sometimes demons come in for witches. Wizard, marine, they come in form of smoke, black smokes. That's how demons come in form of black smoke. This black smoke we enter. When you enter, it will not form a shape of whatever it is and start operating. Okay. Some enter and turn to snake, turn to anything to operate. But all these things are there, the antidotes to neutralize all those negative forces that are inside your house. And you are praying and telling God that they are celebrating Christmas. Celebration will never cease in your home. Anything that is, is in this as causing quarrel, you and your partner is always quarreling. Children are stubborn, things are tough, that you are wiping them away. Anything God never planted in this house, that God through this uh, cleaning, that God should send them away. Because he said holiness is what he needs. So when you are done making those prayers, you remove this thing from the bucket of water, remove the, uh, uh, leave the onions, remove this one, and you put your mopping bucket. Make sure you turn everything around. Mix the salt, every water together. Put to enough water, you put your mopping, your mopping brush. And you mop the floor, mop the kitchen, mop the room, mop everywhere. If you finish mopping, you can spray in your air freshener to make that place smell good. By this thing, you have done stage one. Watch out for stage two of our end of the year house cleaning. All right.